So today, what we have here is Scribbler Nano 3D Pen. So the Scribbler, I was looking for a 3D Pen. They had the version 3, I believe, and then they had a the Duo. And then I saw this one, the Nano. And I was looking online to see if I could see any reviews or any like anything about this pen and I couldn't find anything. Um, so I just decided, you know what, hey, let me get this and uh, let me just check it out. So here I have it, the Nano. I'm gonna go ahead and open it. Nice box, nice box. And then, oh, comes with this. The book that uh, basically tells you what the pen is. I'll, I'll look at this later. And then here, we have the pen. Very, very nice pen. Very small. Look at that later. It comes with uh, the filaments. It comes with multiple colors and it's PLA. Then we got small little uh, screwdriver. Put that back in there. I guess the power or this uh, brick, power brick. And then, and in this box we have the, oh that's a very nice, it looks to be corded. This pen, it, give, it, it gives you multiple different colors. The pen that I have, it's actually gold. To turn this on, to power this on, you're just gonna connect the plug-in right here in the middle. Depending on the temperature you choose, on top it'll say um, the type of plastic you'll be using. The lowest it goes to is 130. The highest it goes to is 230. Once it's warmed up, these are no longer your temperature buttons no more. So if you click it, it'll start pushing it backwards. And you gotta click it again to stop it. Now this one is the extruder to go forward. When you press it, it'll go. When you let go, it'll stop. If you double click it, it'll be a continuous. And if you just click it again, it'll stop. Double click it. These become your speed. So the highest it goes to is six, and the lowest it goes to is one. The point of the speed is so, uh, depending on how fast you want to work or how fast you want it to extrude. So you can be having it in the slow mode so you can take your time, or you can have your speed, um, bump up the speed to make it go faster. It just depends on what you like. I like it at four, but it's just all personal preference. You get this small little stick. And there's a little hole here, and then you would want to press the double, double click it to keep it continuous. Then you would just put it in the hole, and you'll, you'll feel like start pushing itself in. Then you see it go. And then you're gonna see it extrude out in a minute. There you go. See how fast it goes? So it's right now, it's on number, number three. I like to mention that this is my first 3D pen, so I have nothing to compare it to. It's not too big, it's not too small either. It's It feels nice, it feels natural. Plus the button is right here next to you, so if you, you can draw, we'll go, we'll, we'll, we'll draw a box real quick. Damn, that ran out fast. Damn, that was quick. This is a lot harder than I thought it was gonna be. Now I'm trying to go straight up. Oh, it comes out too fast. Let me redo that again, let me just slow down the speed. Stop there, wait for it to dry up. Bam, let me try to do it again. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Look at that. Look at that, skill. I'm gonna attempt to do a dog. Let's see if I can do a dog. Let's do it, let's do it, let's do a dog. Oh, so another test I wanted to do, I'll probably just make it black. Was, um, so this, is for my um, leftover from my 3D printer filament. I wanted to see if this can work on this. I'm sure it can. So I just have this long slinky thing. So, and then this part's straight. So I'm just gonna go ahead and just put it in here. Click this. Let it catch. There it catches. And there. I don't know how to make a dog. And there's the head. Okay, not bad. Oh, 
Oh shoot, my doll's gonna be fat. <laughs> Maybe I'll crush this a little bit down. Down it, size it down a little bit. Go ahead and wrap that around. That's pretty good. So setting six, speed six. I like it because you can fill in a lot faster. So I like that. I like that they put the speed change there. Well, let me let me go ahead and uh, this looks kind of weird. There you go. And there, here is my dog masterpiece. Only took me an hour to make. But um, yeah, overall this 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 uh, this pen is it's small, compact, and gets the job done. And it's really comfortable. I'm not sure. I'm not sure how other pens feel, but this one I really like. Like I said, yeah, this is a Scribbler Nano 3D pen. They have three different pens: the V3, the Nano, and the Duo. Like I said, I didn't see none of these, so it's a really cool pen. Really small. It was, I'm not sure it's as small as the Lix, but affordable price. Really affordable.